can roast movies that aren't the Wizard of Oz. The Christmas Shoes, more like the Christmas Ooze. 2002, made for TV garbage. This movie stars Rob Lowe, playing the character of Robert. Wow, what a stretch. Frankly, he should have kept the low too, because this was a low point in his career. This story stars a young boy who finds out that his mother is dying, and while she's on her deathbed, does he spend time with her? No, he spends the entire movie saving up money so he can buy her a pair of red dancing shoes, because he wants her to look beautiful in heaven for Jesus. You'll have to excuse me, I didn't realize that heaven had a dress code. Is God just a fashion expert up there going, Hey, sweetheart, welcome to heaven. Look, your soul and everything is beautiful, but those shoes, they gotta go. Spend time with your dying mother, you little turd sandwich. Hey, buddy, you know what your mother would appreciate more than shoes? Maybe some better health care. The Christmas Shoes isn't just an awful movie. It's also an awful book and a very awful song. It's a trash trifecta. The Christmas Shoes song is sung by the band New Song, which is hilarious because the whole time it was playing, I kept on going, New Song! New Song, please! Can you imagine for me how annoying it is to hear the same song playing over and over again in The Christmas Shoes that describes the entire plot of the movie The Christmas Shoes? That is the definition of Overkill, sir, I want to buy these shoes for my mama, please. It's Christmas Eve and these shoes are just her size. Could you hurry, sir? Daddy says there's not much time. You see, she's been sick for quite a while and I... No, these shoes would make her smile, and I want her to look beautiful if Mama meets Jesus tonight. Do you like a movie better than the woo? Comment below, and I will roast you. And if you want to join my tadpole tribe, go right ahead and click subscribe. Ring that bell. Ring-a-ding-a-ding-a-ding-a-ding!